Hey y'all, Andrew Reed, Moss Creek Mushrooms. Uh, today we're having a bit of a snow day. Everyone called in, so I stayed home and played hooky myself. Uh, the only one that worked today was Samantha, who went out and did deliveries, and she's already back. So uh, with that, guys, today I've just got a short video for you based on a blog post I wrote. And um, oh yeah, I, I really appreciate how much you guys like that Halloween video that Tristan and I did. But uh, I'll be honest. Since he's gotten so much praise for it, like through phone calls and everything, um, he just keeps showing up to work in that dang mask. It's it's really kind of unnerving. Like, you know. Anyways, that said, if you all could just slow that down a little bit, maybe Tristan will, you know, maybe he'll he'll come back to work normal. Um, <laughs> but that with that, y'all... Enjoy the video. Enjoy your weekend. I'll see you guys next week, Wednesday. Keep swanning culture, y'all. Good Enough by Andrew Reed. Many farmers I know are perfectionists, which is why I think so many of you wince when I tell you I'm not going after the best mushroom I can grow. I try to grow good enough mushrooms. And that right there has so many connotations that I can already hear many of you fungal flesh ranchers groaning in pain. Maybe it'll help if I tell you that I'm secretly a perfectionist too, at least when it comes to some things. I want my mushroom growing systems to be perfect, and if they are, then I'll already be growing the finest mushrooms possible. Putting your focus on growing the most perfect mushrooms is going to create a system with problems very quickly. You're going to be, you're going to baby those mushrooms, you're going to tweak your system for every efficiency, and you're going to quickly become overwhelmed with just how much work is involved in growing large quantities of perfection. A true Sisyphean task, if ever there were one. If you focus entirely on the overall system of production and grow, quote-unquote, good enough mushrooms, your quality of mushrooms will rise. You will be surprised by the reduction in your workload and your farm will become more profitable as a matter of course. Consider the most common killer of the budding mushroom farm, burnout. It is fatal and has by far the largest body count of mushroom farms that I've ever encountered. Most mushroom farmers I've met are all too willing to slave away for the mushrooms to make sure that they have the most perfect product possible. An admirable goal for sure, but I feel like it's a focus on symptoms over the actual problem. The problem isn't growing perfect mushrooms, but rather producing good enough mushrooms profitably. Profit is energy. It is the bread of life for a business, and without it, your business will starve. Burnout is equivalent to starvation. Likewise, your business provides for you in accordance with your care for it. If you don't make the hard decisions and remove non-productive parts, those parts will waste energy, profit, rather, and that will eat away at what your business can give back to you. Any part of your system that doesn't add value or maintain that value in the end product is unnecessary. In other words, don't look to the value of what you are producing, but rather at the infrastructure that produces that value. Like I'm on my tiptoes, baby, you think a little too small I got big goals, baby, ain't where the money at Look, I just need the info, pronto I go and get it and split it with my kinfolk daily And I'm the type of nigga that might change my number on ya Yeah, that's how you react when people took a slumber on ya Pretty brown skin, baby, I can see the summer on ya You see all the bread and I know it make you wonder Don't you, don't you, don't you, Ooh. I ain't surprised at all, seen them rise and fall Went up the mountain, it wasn't hard to climb at all At the top I found some relief, I finally got some peace Carry on, but please don't mess up the mood Yeah, I worked too hard for it No, I need to beat it before you mess up the mood Yeah, ooh, I worked too hard for it And I need it, so please don't mess up the mood Don't, 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 don't mess up the mood
out the kitchen yeah. I can make a hit on whatever you pitching <laughs> Baby, let me fill up whatever you missing Know you like it up at the top, it's a better view in it I'm not surprised at all, no way Hey, what you need, come on, just pay the fee I supply it all, went up the mountain And it wasn't hard to climb at all At the top I found some relief, you see So please don't miss up the moon yeah. I went too hard for it No, I need it, beat it, oh, you mess up the moon Alright, alright, ooh I went too hard for it And I need it, so please don't mess up the moon Don't, 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 don't mess up the moon Garbage! <laughs>